Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, power, and glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, power, and glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, power, and glory, forever and ever. Amen. I offer you this bread and this ghee, salt, and olive oil. Jesus Christ, I recognize you as one who has the consciousness always from your birth until you went on from this world. That is the same as the source, the all. God. You and he shared consciousnesses. He took on the human body in order to try to help us, show us our true inner nature. And you went as far as to be willing to sacrifice yourself for us human beings. All avatars do similar things that you, you came at a time when there was more focus on ritual than love, on semantics than mercy, on offering rather than understanding. Jesus Christ, I only hope that I can learn from your sacrifice and apply it to my own life, that I may also sacrifice for humanity in all the things that I do, as I believe I have been doing, but there are grander levels of sacrifice. I need to work on myself within far more than I would like to admit, but at the same time, heaven is inevitable. Truth will triumph, and wisdom is always wonderful, and hate always foolish. With the power that you grant humanity, Jesus Christ, we have taken routes that are ultimately better than where we were. I pray that you watch over humanity, Jesus Christ. And I would also like to admit a personal desire. I wish to keep on returning to this earth, even if it becomes hellish, even if it means I'm not raptured, to aid those here, to ascend to where the Father is, no matter how many times it takes for me to be born. No matter what I go through, 
I wish to return as long as there are those who wish true and complete union with God, the source, the all. I respect you, Jesus Christ, and I understand you through the workings in books Yokananda and Kriyananda have produced. I do not understand you as most people understand you. I am not Christian. But you never said you were a prophet. And you said you were the son of God so that we would all realize our own innate nature. This was mercy from you because as an avatar, you had pure divine consciousness, oneness with God in mind. But you came to tell us of our own abilities, not who you were. I hope that more people understand this. I hope mo more people understand that we all have that spark within us, however small. The soul is what gives us power over all beings. We human beings have been chosen by God, created by God in order to both choose him or reject him and to imagine and create in ways all other beings cannot. There have been those who, those beings who cannot accept this and refuse to realize human significance. But those beings damn themselves for human beings have been granted with the ability to create and imagine in ways that no other being can. May the eyes of other beings who seek us to be harmed be averted. May their envy not scorch our flesh or bury itself within our hearts. May your message continue, Jesus Christ. Thank you for all that you do. Protect my family, my friends. Reveal yourself even more to Joshua. And be the guide that you've always been. And we always need you to be that guide, to perform that role. I honor you, Jesus Christ, and I say a final prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, power, and glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Amen.